Hey everybody, it's Sherry at the Crafty Decorator. Happy Saturday, everybody. I'm back. I'm back with another quick pre-recorded video. This time, I want to show you the Dollar Tree flowers. And then I'll show you the Walmart and the Dollar Tree together. And you can decide what you want to do. Again, I'm showing you now because, oh my God, our Dollar Tree is slim pickings for fall already. It's slim pickings. So... For my long, in case you missed my last video, you always want to start with something long. So these are called Dripping Blossoms. I got three different colors. I got this reddish color, I got this yellow, and I got orange. So I am going to start. Again, you bend here. So you're going to look curved and you're going to place these towards the center of your top soil. So in case you haven't seen before, this is an $8 urn from Dollar General and I whitewashed it. You can see how you do that um, or dry brushed it with white chalk paint. Uh, then I have a rock in here to weigh this down because this is only light plastic. And I put topsoil in there. The reason I use topsoil and not styrofoam is because I'm changing them out every season. And I'm going to be poking all different holes in there. Topsoil, I just find it easier and it weighs it down better. So start by placing all of your colors around or whatever you choose. It could be leaves, whatever you choose. But I am just going to alternate like my colors around. I'm going to alternate my colors and spread them out. Let's see. What do I want here? This a red. And the yellow. So I am using, how many am I using? One, two, three, four. This is five. I'm using eight. I'm using eight of these drooping blossoms for my container because they're they're really not full. They're kind of skimpy, but eight of those. And I just alternate my colors. Um, this is what I'm looking like in this in here in the pot. Then I just loved these, and I can only find three. And I switched out my pumpkins. Because this is the tiny little pumpkin that comes on here. And you can't even like hardly see it. So these are the Dollar Tree pumpkins. So I bought three of these because I only found three of these pretty red flowers. And I am going to place these. These are like my big, say my big bushes that I use at from Walmart there. I am placing those. Kind of up front. I'm going to put something in the center. I bought, so those are called, that's just called a bouquet. That's all it says. These are mums. These are yellow mums. Make sure you bend them. And you're just going to stick them in your dirt. So I have yellow mums. I have my bouquet. Uh, let's see. I'm trying to see here. I have, whoops. I'm going to stick this one back here, just on this side. You just play with it to see what you like. Now I have, these are hydrangeas, they're orange, and I think I want one of those. I think I want one of those. I kind of want these pumpkins. I'm going to arrange them so they're by my lantern. I'm going to arrange, arrange them. So I am using three of those red bouquets. Um, I am going to use three of these mums. Use three of these mums. I'm going to spread them out here.
And I have three of these hydrangea ones. Okay. So this is what I'm looking like so far. This is what I'm looking like. Then I put my lantern in there. And I probably, they need to be dusted out. Let's see. I put my lantern in here. My lantern is from Michael's and I push it down in there. Okay, I want my pumpkins to be like on the corners of my lantern there. This one doesn't want to go on my corner though. Let's see. Okay, there. There. Okay, and then I have an orange one back here on the corner. Since I didn't have another red flower to hook the pumpkin to, the bouquet, I just stuck another pumpkin on a pick. And I'm probably, like, crooked. I have a hard time seeing this way. I need to be looking at it. Okay, I'm going to stick. I think it needs to move up this way more. i got to make sure I'm, like, good. I don't want to be showing you stuff that isn't right. <laughs> I can't stick it in without looking at it. I got to go around here. My leaves are in the way from the flowers. So I got to make a space. Okay, there we go. Okay. <laughs> so here are my flowers, my blossoms hanging. Now, I needed something else in there with the blossoms. So I bought the leaves from Dollar Tree. I have all different kinds of leaves. I got uh, maple leaves, oak leaves, we oh no uh maple leaves oak leaves and grape leaves i don't know they kind of all look the same to me when i was grabbing them they're the same color so i'm using them so bend your wire so you're looking like you're uh curved and i am sticking these in here too because it needs more it needs more around now, I might move them again. I got to see where I'm doing here. And I want them down. But it needed some leaves with the flowers. So, let's see here. And I am using six of these. I am using six of these leaves. Oh, that one's too close. Like I said, when you're done with this, you might play with it again. Um, I know you can't see me, but it's important you see the, the plant. Okay, let me come back around. Now, you can add as many pumpkins as you want if you want to add more pumpkins. Okay. There we go. Okay, looking pretty cool, isn't it? It's looking pretty. It's looking pretty. Okay, 
Then, you know, I want to add something around my lantern. So then you don't see this, like all of these stemmy things, your stems all bent over. So I bought the wheat. I bought the wheat. And what I do, I'm going to stick on the side. You might need to, let's see, I kind of stick it towards the corner. I want one up front. And then I'm going to stick another one towards the corner. And then one on the side, one on the back corner. This one needs to move over a little more this way. Like I said, you might be moving them around. <laughs> you might be moving them around. As you go, you'll see what you want, what you don't want. I need one on this side. I'm trying to see around. Okay. One over here. The leaves are really thick there. All right. I should have one more, but Bring some of my flowers back over. My little flowers here are getting lost. Okay. There we go. Okay. And this is the Dollar Tree. This is the Dollar Tree. Let's see. My batteries might be dead in this. Oh, I think my batteries are dead in there. Or I don't have it turned on. Let's see. No, it's on. The batteries are dead. There's no switch on the back there. So my batteries are dead. I need new batteries in that one. Okay, so this is the Dollar Tree one. And this costs $34 for me to fill. So all of these, including the extra pumpkins I bought, is $34. Let me show you now if I could get both of them. I don't know if I can get both of them in the camera. I'm a little crooked here for moving it around. All right. I'm going to see if I can kind of move them so you can see both. I don't know. You really can't see both. Okay. Dollar Tree. That's the Dollar Tree one. And this is the Walmart one that I just did a while ago to show you. There's the Walmart one. I wish there was a way I could show you both together. <laughs> Walmart Dollar Tree. There you go. <laughs> I hope you like them, guys. I think they're so pretty. Uh, and gosh, I'm looking forward to fall now. I'm looking forward to fall. The colors are beautiful. This one is very bright, and that one is more muted. I'm kind of liking the muted one a little better. Um, but this is pretty. Depending how much fall color you want, I'm kind of liking that one better. I'm kind of liking the Walmart one better. Okay, thanks for joining me. I'll talk to you all later. Bye.